Okay, I took care of your charm problem. Who's that? It's me. Remember me? I helped with those dogs. I've been seeing about this curse of yours. Welcome, brother. It's a dark omen. Those charms out in the woods, yeah. they all been broken. All of them? So I guess that's it for your suffering. Ah! It's a miracle! We're saved! The darkness lifted! Not saved. Huh? Cursed. Uh. He broke the charms. And the spirits are set loose. We're doomed then? Yeah. Hold on. You said the charms was protecting the curse. I said it was a dark omen. I said he had the demon's tongue. Now I, I, I need to, I need some light here now. I, I don't know what to think. Hey, huh? look at me. Yeah. I think something's going on in this holler. And it ain't a curse. And whatever else it ain't, this feller don't want you to know. Liar! I told you he would lie and dissemble. Something's up, and this one wouldn't be so quick with ideas he didn't have some clue of it. I have the gift, my ancestor. Well, I got a gift right here. I'm <laughs> going to commune with the spirits. Dark, dark omens, dark spirits. Lord. What is he hiding? He, he, always, he always spoke truthful to us. There, there is a dig on the other side of the hill there. There was a dig anyway. It's closed now. He always said something about not going over there. Well, maybe I'll take a look at that dig. Yeah. See if I can see something. Uh, right. I think we will see something. Secrets he's hiding. Oh, be to you if you knock me down. Wait, is it a little bit farther? Oh, it is. Okay, then I'll go there and see you there. This was a poison of this mine, some curse, my ass. He was exploiting the people for damn sure. Rabbit trying to swing. <laughs> Come on, you're gonna stand there. I shall, but first, you have to mark your signs on this paper. It's a powerful magic that will protect you on your journey. Uh, I, I hereby will release, will absolve, and, and, and indemnify the aforementioned Roanoke Fuel Company. Stop reading. Hmm? You didn't tell me you could read. 
What kind of trick you pulling now? Oh, you're back! We thought the curse had got you. Nope, but he nearly did. Don't you go nowhere. I was down that old dig, and I found this. Leaking all the way into the lake. Uh, You've been poisoned. No, no, no. We, we, we were warned not to heed what you That's say. Right. Well, let him tell you then. What's this? It's nothing. Nothing? Oh, then you won't mind taking oh, a drink. Hey, no. hey, hey, hey! No, please! Hey! No! No! no. 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 Oh, you've killed me! I'm poisoned! Poison now, is it? Uh, oh, the dig. All he found was arsenic and lead. I dug down into the cave system and spread. I was meant to uh, get you all to go. Uh, now you heard it. It's taken me. Oh, oh dear. Dear God, oh, there's no arguing. It's clear as day. We're cursed. <laughs> Curse? What are you talking about? Powerful forces have taken on this town. It ain't oh, spirits. Yes. It's a mining company. No, it is spirits. Spirits taken through a mining company. Brothers <laughs> and sisters, we got some praying to do. Yes. Yes. Don't pray. Do something. You'll die. Or you worse. Just go. It's our curse. It's ours to deal with. Now the medicine man left some money. They just take it if you want it. Jesus, screw your money, don't need it. Morons, ah, you. You'll be your own curse, idiots. It's running there. Oh. I had a bite of that plan over there, and it hit my guts like a freight train. Oh, it's that little one over there with the pink flowers. I'd stay well clear of that if I was you. Yeah, I think you've sold me on that plan. Tell me about it. I, I need it for my arrows and knives. The first time I see someone poisoned by this herb. I'm not an outlaw yet. Interesting. I thought I was an outlaw. Guess I'm an outlaw. <laughs> Dutch, I'm not feeling too good. Pearson? Hello. Feeling too good is understatement. White to D4. Black to F5. White to G3. Knight to F6. Bishop. To G2. Black. To G6. Knight. To F3. White. To D4. Black. To F. You okay there? Working it all out. Once and for all, Arthur. Mm. What now? We're back. And I'm sitting here. And I am contemplating the great journey of the sun and considering a famous chess move. Those oily enactors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and their benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. They want us. And they are going to have us. Well, maybe they ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just, well, I can't help but feel we would have been better running off someplace else. <laughs> but the, the game ain't over, Arthur. I mean, I ain't, I ain't played my... My final move, but I guess I'm more interested in saving lives than winning a chess. And maybe life ain't such a thing to cling on to so tightly, no doubt. What about the women? You sound like Hosea. 
I miss. Um, I asked you a question. What do you think? We can't stay here. That much is obvious. Where are we gonna run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. Arthur, do you have my back? Always, Dutch. But there's more than your back to worry about. <laughs> we need more money. We've been on the run for months now, and I seen you killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to. And I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we there just... is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek, I believe we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you can take folks up that way. Micah and I need to do some reconnaissance. I just came from there. I ain't there. got a final plan yet. Arthur, I ain't got it. I just need time. I need time and no traitors. I just came from there. I just did a couple of missions there. Help the folk there. My buddy. Charles. Will you ride with me? Always. Where are we headed? Up past Butcher Creek. It's Murphy Brew Country. Yeah. That's why I'm asking you to ride with me. Oh man, in, in five minutes they ambushed me like three times. What are we doing there? We're looking for a place to hold up. Hello, Mr. Smith. Even the law hey. won't follow us up there too willingly. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while you boys were away. And? Mm. You'll see. <sighs> You'll see what? You think I'm, I'm gonna away. be surprised? Follow me. By another... Uh, those savages ambushes? I won't. I was already surprised. They laid a trap for me, which I willingly fell into. Jesus. Yep. I thought we were leaving now. There's a small problem Easy. with the horse. We need to get this done fast. The Pinkertons will have reinforced in another day or two. Yeah, the sooner we get out of here, the better. It's quite a ride up there. I saw some canoes near the bridge up river, which would take us right up to Butcher Creek. Might be quicker. What do you think? I say we just ride it. It ain't worth messing around with boats. Okay, sure. It's good to see you again, Charles. You too. Thanks for what you did in Sam Denis. Real brave drawing them off us like that. I was worried you and Abigail had both got yourselves killed. I found a spot to lie low for a while, then managed to get a ride with a wagon of workers heading out to the fields. Abigail said she somehow managed to slip away when they grabbed Hosea. You did good getting the others out of there, keeping everyone together. Everybody was pretty shaken up when I got back to Shady Bell. Uh, it was a tough few days. I couldn't have done it without Sadie. So how did you find that spot back there? I assume the skulls on sticks weren't an addition to yours. <laughs> Old Strauss knew about it. The locals are terrified of the place, so we figured that might buy us some time. And it did. Until one of you brought the law with you. But where did you end up again? Cuba? Oh, uh, not exactly. An island off of there called Warma. Landed ourselves in a heap of trouble. Really? A tropical island? Isn't that just what Dutch wanted? Uh, Not exactly. I guess it didn't exactly live up to his ideas. Anyway, I ain't always sure our Dutch knows what he wants anymore. Perhaps not. But he's always managed to figure things out in the past. I know. Hey, you're right. I'm just... It's been. Uh, guess I just miss Hosea and his uh, wisdom, you know. Of course.
Moron. Well, there's the bridge. Wanna blow up now? Dangerous this much weight on this bridge. I just returned from this place, damn it. It's not much further now. So I spent some time up this way while you were gone. I ran into rainsfall and eagle flies, the Indians. And I've been trying to help out a bit where I can at the reservation. Things are bad there. Uh, that's not a surprise. They seem to be in a lot of trouble. Heading into more. Some men there spoke a lot about the Murphy gang that hides out in these caves. A place called Beaver Hollow. They're animals. <sighs> Everyone is terrified of them. Just recently, a stagecoach from Annisburg disappeared without that's, a trace coming That's through. where I was ambushed. Great. Dutch didn't mention this. Well, hiding up here. It's not a crazy idea. This is a spot nobody comes near. Even the law. But just be ready. It won't be pretty. You see that up ahead? Slow down, keep it quiet. It could be some of them. I'll kill them, I kill them on sight. I say we dismount here and follow them on foot. See where they're going. Follow me, stay quiet. What did you give me the... What the... Maybe because we need the quiet, so they gave me the bow. Jesus. Let's get closer to him. F you, idiot. Come on, up this way. Definitely Murphy's. I say we deal with them from here. You take one, I'll take the other. Then who do the carrying? Here is quick, Arthur. Bitch, you know that. Good job. Ooh, what weapon is this? Machete. Oh, we must be close now. Let's stop and have a look from the top of this hill there. Stagecoach went missing. Jesus. Holy they shit. Must be in the cave. All right. Let's get on with this. Okay. What you think? I'm gonna head into the cave and flush them out with dynamite. I'll head in. Let's surprise them in there. Okay. 
Start cave. I found it myself. I had inside. I tried to kill them. But I, it was a complete fail because it was empty. Those bricks in CD are his luck. Should burn the sons of bitches. Flush them with dynamites, we can go up there. I've been here. I found this place with my own eyes. Then I head inside. Completely empty. Someone's coming out of the cave. I'll keep watch. You deal with that one in the entrance. Quietly. Quietly. What the fuck? What the fuck? Holy shit, freaking savages, barbarians. I was here, it was empty, god damn it. behind them I think oh nice nice So that's their headquarters. I've been here. I wanted to kill them because of the ambushes. They continued to ambush and harass me. Bad for Morgan. He's sick. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Where 
Where are you from? Antisburg. What do we do with her? We take her there and I'll go get the others. Sure. Miss, you okay to ride on my horse a little? I'll keep you safe. She's freaked out, of course. Hannesburg, right? Yes. They... 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 Um... It's okay, miss. The others, they... They killed them. You're safe now. Just... Try to breathe. They're animals. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's all right, miss. Why would they? <laughs> Some folks is just evil. Ain't no point trying to explain it. I haven't slept in days. <laughs> I know. What's your name, miss? It's okay. Meredith. You're gonna be home soon, Meredith. And this will all be over. Thank you. Where in Annisburg? One of the mining cottages. Um, <laughs> if you get me to the main street, I can show you from there. Okay. Just try to relax now. Yeah, sick animals. I tried to kill them. I tried to ambush them myself. I went in armed to the teeth, dynamites and everything. Heavy weaponry trying to kill all of them in that cave. It was just a complete fail. It was empty. I guess I wasn't insane after all. I guess this cave was used by them after all. Because it looks like a fail. I started recording when I entered the cave, just I ended up with empty cave. So I looked like an idiot. But now this proves I ain't one. Yours. Up at the top of the hill. It's near the blacksmith. Come on, then. Ma! Ma! Meredith! Yes. She's alive! Oh, she's alive! You saw some pretty bad things, I'm afraid, man. Murphy Brew got us. Oh, my God. How did you manage uh, to? I just ran into them and found her. Oh, thank you. Here, let me no, give you this. Don't need. Decline, of course. Oh, that, that's okay, ma'am. You just. Keep her warm and keep her safe. This is down. Oh no. You again. You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. First time she put the law on me in Saint Denis. Crazy. How you get on? Okay. Found a girl. Took her home. Oh. You and Mike find anything? Maybe. I think maybe. I found our old friend Mr. Cornwall. You did? 
Yeah, he's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella, isn't he? Mike and I'll sniff about, see if he knows we're here, and exactly what his plans are. So, Dort! Did you miss me? I found her drunk as Saint Denis. You're back. How jolly, Miss it's O'Shea. It's funny, you suck of shit. Back Who and are you? drunk. The master, the Lord Molly. God Almighty. Calm down. I won't be ignored. Dutch Vanderlyn, I am in him. I ain't her. Or any of your stooges. Calm yourself. You don't owe me nothing. Miss. I don't owe you nothing. Nothing. Okay. I'll spit in your eye. I did. I told them. I'm sorry? Yeah, I told them and I tell them again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who what? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross of the bank robbery. And I wanted them to kill you. You did what? I loved you, you goddamn bastard! Go on, She's shoot crazy. me! She ain't worthy. <laughs> you told on oh, me! You're you not betrayed so big now, me! Why? You betrayed all Come of us. Down. Arthur? <laughs> She's a fool. Get her out of here. You know the rules. You are not so big now. Hurry, Your Majesty! You. Take her! Well done. She knew the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you. Quit your lollygagging. Get back to work. Yeah. Chapter 6 Beaver Hollow She did She was the traitor Holy shit Well, like I said in previous videos It was good riddance Betrayed everyone just because Dutch ignored her. She couldn't cope with it. <coughs> Crazy. <sighs> Complete chapter five. That's no. She's not nasty. She did the right thing. Deliver Meredith to her mother within two minutes. Get 15 headshots, complete with at least 85 accuracy. Get the hell out of here. Need to shoot her? You seem to like it. I saw that speedy look in your eyes. You're drunk again. And you're a fucking murderer. She broke the rules. She did no such thing. She was in love. You sour-faced old crow. God damn you. Murderer. Murderer. Morgan. You hit the bottle. Continue with the bottle. Never stop. I'm worried about you. No, go away, Arthur. <laughs> <sighs> she's in a bad way. She don't know what she's saying. This is hitting everyone hard in different ways. I don't know. I still think you did the right thing. They lost so many people because of her. So you think. You think Dutch has lost his mind, Arthur? I don't know anymore. I'm not sure I even care. Well, Micah... Micah says you've been saying crazy things about him. Micah. <laughs> Keep an eye out for Micah, Bill. He says a whole lot. Shit. <laughs> okay. Yes, I'll leave you to it then. All right. Can you even drink this without coughing it? Oh my god. Nah. <coughs> Just keep moving. Yeah, that did bad. Listen to me. Mike, huh? All you. Listen. 
We're here. And we are safe now. And that is the main thing. Nobody listens, Dutch. Listen to me. You have got to keep faith. You've got to. Now I know. I know. I miss Jose. I surely do. I miss every man and every woman who fell. I do. And I would die in their place gladly if I could. This world is un kind but it won't break me not while I have you by my side we we get some money and we can still they won't catch me they won't catch me! And I promise, whosoever stands by my side, they won't catch you neither. Is it neither or neither? They won't. I think in the end, Micah may betray me and not Dutch. By betray, I mean kill, try to kill. I think it will be Micah and not Dutch. Hey, get up. Looks like I can't enter to talk to him, huh? Okay, let's see about everyone else in the camp. You okay? I guess. I didn't really know Molly so well. Thanks for your help. Well, secure in this lovely spot. I'm not sure how lovely it is. It still reeks of those savages. But it looks every spot is near water, one way or another. Edit those. You saw Edit those on an artist board. Oh yeah, right. Well, she's a crazy, crazy bee. Sadie Adler. Now available. Only now. LS Leopard Strolls. Leopold. Oh. Okay. Guess I'll see you later then. Right out there. So here we are. Can't believe that bitch Molly ratted us out. Yeah. Uh, if she even did. Well, try to keep your head straight. Okay, Arthur. So here we are. I like what you done with the place. As long as it keeps folk away, I don't care. Yeah. Well, don't give up on everything just yet. All right. It looks like Arthur is not sure. He thinks maybe... Maybe she didn't. Maybe she was really bluffing there. Maybe it wasn't definitive, actually. Huh. She was drunk, maybe spewing bullshit and lies. That was a very... Very quick action there. How you feeling about Molly? 
I'm feeling she got exactly what she deserved. That's what I figured. Anyway, I'll leave you to it. Whatever. Poor Karen. Hey. How are you coping? I am fantastic. Great. Uh -huh. Whatever you say. Pearson. You okay? What is happening to us? Just make this place work, Pearson. For now. Well, try to keep your head straight. Okay, Mr. Morgan. You okay, Tilly? Molly got what she deserved. Nearly got us all killed. <sighs> yeah. She knew the rules. Okay. Guess I'll see you later then. Okay then. I know how you girls laugh at me. I used to laugh at women just like me when I was young and pretty and sure of the world. We don't laugh at you, miss. You do. And you're right, too. I'm laughable. Pitiable. But it'll happen to you, too. They'll stop looking soon enough, and that glass in your hand won't be so friendly, neither. Tell her, Mr. Morgan. Tell her Tell what? Her about time. Yeah. I don't know too much about time, Miss Grimshaw. That's a bit beyond me. Well, maybe I'll get lucky and die first. Yes. Well, get to work. <laughs> Vanity won't help you, young or old. Ah, <sighs> uh, long dead. Okay. Mary Beth. Morning. Okay, not gonna talk about what just happened. Fine. Hi, Charles. <sighs> Why don't you sit here away from Micah? <laughs> Morning. Hello. Cowpoke, I wanted to speak to you. You're just gonna sit there and not care. Don't get Dutch any more worked up than he already is. I don't know what you mean. Yes, you do. Okay. Guess I'll leave you to it then. Just go rest up, Morgan. That's all you do. Things are gonna be okay, Jack. Can I go play in the caves? No. I ain't safe in there. Well, don't give up on everything. That's what I wanted yet. to say. Definite okay. no. Arthur beat me to it. Hi, Mary Beth. Hi, Mary Beth. What? Yes. What kind of response is this? Mr. Yes. Morgan. <laughs> Strauss. Herr Strauss. Hair. It's a hair. About. About how I look. Okay. Are you, um. Are you perhaps available for some work? Debtors? Yes. I guess. Your commitment to your duties is admirable. <coughs> you know, Mr. Morgan, you are. Well. I'm sorry for you. Hmm? No, never mind. I didn't... Look, Strauss. You take care. I ain't dead yet. No, of course not. That's what I was saying. I... Uh, I... A debtor, uh, Strauss. Who owes you money? Well, uh, there's a deserter from Fort Wallace. Head to him first. They're looking for him out on the road near Three Sisters. Man's name is J. John Weathers. J. John Weathers. Then there's a miner over in Annisburg. He's called... Well, he's called Arthur. Like you. Mm. <laughs> Arthur Londonderry. Family man, desperate. You <laughs> know the type. Couldn't one of the boys do this? I tried. They lacked your... Intellect. Vigor, huh? <laughs> All right. Uh, take care, uh, uh, Mr. Morgan. All the gang money are marked on the map with a dollar sign. Seek out the debtors and recover the money slash debt. There is no. It's Mary Beth. Where is Abigail? 
What she thinks about this situation? Good morning. Hi. Yeah, Le Moine. Ning. Can't even find Abigail. Ah, oh, he opened the tent. Hi, Arthur. Molly. I don't yes, believe Arthur? it. I should have cut her loose months ago. Well, let's get settled into our new home, I guess. What is it now? Anyway, I'll leave you to it. Run along now. You're a wrong man. A wrong man. There's something not right with you. Are you talking to me, old man? Mind your manners. I've minded them long enough. None of our problems is my fault. None at all. So you watch your damn tongue. <laughs> Stay away. Mark. Yeah. You happy now? Happy about what? Look around you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Shut the hell up, who's this idiot? Where is Abigail, damn it? 